Morning friends, <laughs> how you doing? Um, oh my god, I've been up since half five. This is the simple hydrating sheet mark, mask, hyaluronic acid, water boost. Um, oh my god, I've been up since half five this morning. I woke up and usually I'd go back to sleep for a couple more hours, but I was like, do you know what? No, I'm gonna get up, I'm gonna get ahead. I'm not saying this is how the rest of Vlogmas is gonna go, I can't promise that. But I've already edited and I've already done my thumbnail. I've got it unlisted and it's quarter, quarter past 7 a.m. The sun's not even up. Um, my little teddy t-shirt. Oh my God, are you obsessed with this? Look. Oh my God, so I ordered this from a woman on Etsy called High Tops Co. Um, and she does all these like personalized t-shirts and you know how much I'm obsessed with Teddy. We're gonna go see her today. Um, look, please. Oh my God, isn't it the best thing you've ever seen? So yeah, I will leave a link in the description if you wanna sort that out. Um, this morning, I thought we could go for brekkie. Um, I need to wash my fake tan off. Might help myself to another coffee. And um, yeah. Get ready for the day. Oh my God, what a great start to day two. So I really hope you enjoyed Vlogmas day one. You're not gonna believe this, and this may be a really, really, really insane thing. Um, but one of my favorite, <laughs> this isn't very Christmassy at all, but I've got to be honest with you. Um, one of my favorite games at the minute is the Texas Chainsaw Massacre game. And obviously it's very lighthearted. No, I'm joking. It is a survival online game where you can play as the victims or the family. And basically you need to find ways to escape, ways to survive. And some days when I need a little pep in my step to start my day, as I make my morning coffee, I go and I play this game. And when I tell you it gets the juices flowing, it gets the adrenaline up, it gets me focused. <laughs> I mean, some people do yoga every morning, some people go to the gym. I play the Texas Chainsaw Massacre game. And do you know what, it helps me so much. I was explaining to my friend Jack the other day, I was just like, look, if you, if you struggle waking up, play this game. It is so high intensity. And basically what you have to do is just like, you have to try and escape the family without them catching you and killing you. And you're playing against other people. And honestly, 15 minutes of a morning, just whilst I'm having my coffee, oh my God, it starts the day wildly. I know it's not gonna make sense to everyone. But anything you can do that makes you like, the blood flowing, the blood pumping. It really does it for me in the morning. Obviously it's not a nice thing. It's not a nice game. But in terms of like, you know, getting yourself going, <laughs> it's a great way. Get in the shower. I'm not gonna wash my hair until tomorrow um, cause we're going out for my mum's birthday tomorrow, uh, which I'm so excited about. I really need to stop saying super excited. Even though I get super excited about so many things, I say it so much, and I'm really trying not to say it. So I'm, um, tomorrow brings great excitement for my mum's birthday. <laughs> so, uh, um, so yeah, I'm gonna stop yapping. Just doing a little check. Oh. <laughs> Just doing my song of the day. 
Um, just doing a little slug check because there's been a couple of slugs out here recently. And I don't want to step on one. Oh my God, it's very brisk today. But guys, this is what it's like at 7am. It's a lot darker and cloudier in real life. My lovely little view. Ooh, oh my God, it's cold out here. But it's so fresh. I think it'd be good for the old lungs. Hello guys, oh my god, day two of Vlogmas of already exposing my massive forehead. So, blank canvas. I wanted to go through um, the steps I do to achieve my everyday face. So I saw Mimi Keen from Sex Education, her Vogue video, and she mentioned that she uses Gleam um, teeth whitening strips. So I bought a bunch, and so far so good, I'm really enjoying them. Um, I only used them a couple of times, but I noticed straight away that my teeth were a little bit whiter. I look like the villain out of Charlie's Angels too, or Charlie's Angels, you know, like the one that sniffs the hair. Anyway, so I use this on my neck. This is the Bondé Sands Gradual Tanning Lotion Tinted Skin Perfector. It's incredible, I really love it. After the shower, I use the Sol de Genonero, sorry, Sol de, this one. I can't pronounce it, I'm so sorry. Sol de Jadonero in the flavour Cheriosa Fragrance. And I also, I don't know if this is bad or not, but I spray a couple of spritzes of my favourite ever fragrance. This was gifted. I love you so much. You can get this in boots now. Uh, Zadig and Voltaire for her. This was sent to me after my Amazon, um, after my Amsterdam vlog. Honestly, incredible. Spray a little bit of that into the moisturiser. My deodorant is the Ritual of Jing, um, which is a really nice. My friend Joe got this for my birthday. So thanks, Jay and You On my face, um, one sec. So to cleanse my face, I use the Bioderm Sensibio Gel Moussent. <laughs> my pronunciations are horrific. So I use that. After the shower, depending on how like sort of dry my skin feels, which actually doesn't after this, I either use the La Roche-Posay um, this is almost empty. This is like a cleansing, soothing spray toner. Or I use the Soothing Facial Toner from Simple, which you just can't go wrong with. This was gifted by Charlotte Tilbury. This is the new Water Magic Cream, which I really like to put gently just under my eye area. Um, I've only just started using well Weleda, Weleda Skin Food. This is so thick so i put that anywhere i need to be moisturized it is the thickest moisturizer i've ever used in my entire life but it is doing the job i feel like i've got a nose whistle <laughs> yeah i do and i mix a little bit of the revlon skin lights face glow illuminator in with this and that's about it that's all i use on my face at the minute oh my god the best thing ever as well this is the rem beauty um so ariana grande's uh, makeup skincare line. This is the cooling blurring under eye balm. This is magic. I don't use primer for my concealer But honestly just a little tiny bit a little goes a long way. Okay, so blank canvas This is like the 399 249 three pound Concealer from last imperfection concealer. Um, this is collection. I use the color beige and I just whack it all over my face Schwarzkopf uh, got to be eyebrow gel. I don't know. It's really good, but I feel like it, I am losing my eyebrows when I use it, when I take it off. I also use the Efacular Duo SPF 30. And to grow my eyebrows and my eyelashes, I use Glow For It Lash Growth, Growth Serum. Oh yes, yeah, so I, I use some of the Filmstar Bronze and Glow Face Sculpt and Highlight. Just a little bit of that. And then I use the Charlotte Tilbury um, Micro Precision Tinted Brow Gel. I'm gonna put my um, instrumental music on now and relax. It's my favorite time. Got the teeth whiteners in. I use this TC um, powder puff to buff everything in. Just like smack it in. I use the Givenchy, pff, very posh, Prism Libre powder. It's got like four different shades, it's like compartments. And this is the Mussolini Aciduli. That's the shade I use. Oh, I look crazy. Just gonna put a little bit of the Charlotte Tilbs. A little sweet. No filler in these. There's no filler in these cheekbones. I get a lot of questions about my cheekbones being filled with filler. Nope. Nothing in them. And then just on the old conquer. Then I get my brow precision thing. 
And then they got to be very lightly smack them up. There we go. Then I'm gonna put my jewelry on because I don't wear my jewelry when I fake tan, apart from these two. I'm gonna be wearing the Laura Mercier Ombre Vanille. It's quite a Christmassy smell. Back of the neck, as always. So this is what you did not see in yesterday's vlog. I need to take this down to my car, so that should be interesting. That should be a mesh. Oh, my train. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> it's so beautiful. Oh my God. It just really reminds me of like a really old sort of Christmas. Walking around the Christmas tree. Ba -ba 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 oh my God, it's freezing. I never understand why sometimes I see seagulls outside my window. Like we're allowed, we're like a, an hour and 10 minutes drive from the sea. Am I really stupid to think that only seagulls hover around the sea? Don't know. But it is very foggy today, friends. So the plan is I'm gonna go get some breakfast at this place called the Ginger Frog, um, which I went with my sister not too long ago. And it, honestly, it is like an independent business. And on, the food was amazing. And it's just like really nice, <clears throat> smoothie, brunchy vibes. So guys, I am ready. Put the hat on because it's absolutely bucking it, bucking it, bucking it, bucketing it down. I'm gonna go to breakfast and then I'm gonna head to my parents because I wanna give my mum a birthday present. It's her birthday tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be quite emotional for her, obviously. Um, my mum's first birthday without her sister. My sister got out loads of photos from when they were a lot younger. So I took them into Snappy Snaps and Basically what they did was they they brought back so much of like the color and restored it and the sharpness and blew them up and Really was incredible. It was like 30 photos for 30 quid. So it was a pound a photo And there was one of my aunt and uncle which you could see the outline But you couldn't see their faces because of like the flash and he restored it and I genuinely thought it was my one uncle but it turned out to be another uncle and I would never have known that unless he'd like pulled the shades down and it took like half hour and um, yeah so what I did is I went and got like a little Stanley knife and I cut around all the photos because my other aunt used to make like these photo collages so I made my mum one of her and her sister and then we can have a really nice day tomorrow um, so yeah I'm gonna go for brekkie then you can get to see Teddy because I know so many of you love Teddy's on my Instagram and yeah let's go oh god here we go Let's hope no one else wants to get in the lift. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Thank God for trolleys, eh? Bloody out, it is so cold. So I've just parked in the Sainsbury's and it's a quick little walk. Oh, that's nice. Looks like a, I've never noticed how much of this looks like a little town, like a little town hall. This is it, the ginger frog. So cute in here, guys. Cute. So this is the menu, guys. It's really amazing food. And then I went for an Americano, and then a green smoothie, mango, spinach, and kale. Very posh. So we've got mushroom, salmon, avocado, tomatoes on gluten-free bread. <laughs> Such a nice vibe in there and the staff are so lovely. So you're ever so if you're ever in Wallington. Um, I definitely recommend going to the Ginger Frog. It's just such a nice vibe. I really, really love it in there. What's everyone's Spotify wrapped? Honestly, my Spotify... No. My top songs were from Scream 6. And one was from Grace and Chance. The rest were from Scream 6. I'm not embarrassed, but even I was a little bit like, Jesus Christ, Mark, get a lot. Home, home for Christmas. Live, laugh, love, scream. Who's ready for some teddy waddles? Hello! Where you up in the blinds pulled down? You 
love it when nobody's around I wanna call out a little delivery from Donut Time. Handle with care. Thank you. Oh, let's see what we've been sent. Merry Christmas. Oh, I thought you'd be coming around here when you smell food. Hey Mark, happy December. Our Christmas collection is here to slay and we're so excited for you to try our Treat Yourself six pack. Oh, Treat Your Elf. Ooh, speak Teddy. <laughs> now available to order online, let the celebrations begin. Donut Time UK, love the donut time. We got some coins. <laughs> Teddy, you can't have that. Treat your elf six pack. Let's see what we got. <gasps> oh wow. Wow. Holy cripes. Oh my god. I've never seen them like that. We've got Will Fur Elf, Candy Cane Lane, Snowy D Channel, Spag Eddie Murphy, <laughs> Christmas Kardashian, and Jack Frostin. Ooh, no donuts for Teddy no. So I'm not the only one who gets given an advent calendar for Christmas. So this is from Morrison's. And what day are we on, Teddy? Can you say two? Can you say day two? <laughs> Can you say day two? Day two. Uh, Woo! Okay, fine. All right, where's day two? Can we find it? Oh, here it is. Ooh. You're a good girl. Are you excited for day two? Oh, what we got in here? Sorry, I put the milk in the wrong cup. Oh my goodness. Can you say Merry Christmas? Woohoo! Oh, yum, yum, yum. Oh, I'm gone. <laughs> God, that was quick. Oh, my goodness. Bloody hell, Ted. Say hello. <laughs> Who's that? Who is he, somebody? Say hello to everyone. <laughs> everyone loves you. Look, say hello, everyone. Say hello, everyone. Say hello. I had a really nice early morning slash to midday with my parents and my sister and Teddy obviously. Um, my sister loved the Teddy t-shirt. Also my mum loved the gift I made her. Tonight, um, this is going to be a pre-filmed thing because I don't know if you follow me on Instagram or TikTok. I went and got a Christmas City Christmas Lights tour around London on a bus, an open air bus. So I thought I could just add that into the end of this video because I've got that footage and basically tonight I'm just going to babysit my friend's dog. Um, so obviously I wouldn't be filming in her flat or stuff like that. So at least I have that from back in November. Guys, you're never gonna believe what just happened. I just dropped my camera and it hasn't worked. Are you joking? Day two. Day two of Vlogmas. Uh, I'm actually Googling to buy a new camera because I thought it was dead. I'm so sorry I dropped you. Oh my God. Uh, it, you just fell out my bag. I wanted to show you guys what I got from Sainsbury's. Fell out the bag. Oh my God. I'm so sorry. I will never drop you again. Okay, so what I got from Sainsbury's um, I really fancy like a stir fry, so I've got ingredients for a stir fry, and then I've got, I wanted to try this, like, I don't ever drink energy drinks, like really rarely, I can't believe I just dropped my camera. So I bought these, just to see, just to see if I, if there was a moment in, um, in Vlogmas where I really needed like a little pick me up, I just thought I'd get like an energy drink, which I just, I never drink, um, so yeah. These are the best apples in the world. These are Braeborn apples, love them. Chest lo lozenges, just in case, because it is very, very cold. And I got a pineapple, mango, and passion fruit. This is just a, like a little snack. Oh my God, I can't believe I dropped my camera. The sheer panic, my heart fell out my bum hole. Day two, 
And I, oh my God. So my lovelies, I'm off now to go babysit my friend's dog for the evening. Um, so enjoy this footage filmed a couple of weeks ago where I go on the bus tour in London. It's super, super cute and wholesome. So I hope you enjoy it and I will see you tomorrow. Love you. Hello. It's now time for the bus tour. So, oh my God, I'm so excited. I think this is gonna be so super cozy. I have a massive scarf that I think I'm gonna wear. Um, which also adds up as a Like a shawl like a bloody blanket. It's massive. Let's just show you what this is gonna be all about Just in case any of you want to do it So it is the London by night with Christmas lights tour golden tours Upper deck Victoria departure now Victoria station for me is literally a godsend to get to literally like 20 minutes on a train, um, which is amazing. So we have to meet at the bus stop one um, at Bullard Way, Buckingham Palace Road um, at 6 p.m. It was th uh, it was 29 pound a ticket, um, which I feel like is really extortionate for a bus trip when you could literally sit on a bus. But because it's open aired, you'll get better views. Obviously I'm doing it on my own. One day this would be amazing to do with the love of my life. But until then, as always, I'm my best friend. Um, we're gonna do it solo. So I'm super excited. I've got like a hoodie, I've got a jacket. Um, my phone, what else do I need? Wallet, oh my God, where is my wallet? Oh, it's here, oh my God. So I've just got the washing machine going, that's why. Just washing me towels. So covered in fake tan. Okay, so we've got a hoodie and we've got like a sort of, um, oh God, it is quite chilly. Ah, oh my God, my ring's cool. Like, this is pretty cool, isn't it? And then the scarf is like massive. Guys, this is the scarf. I don't even want to unravel it, but it is absolutely mahoosive. I just feel like it might be too much, let me see. But I feel like the scarf might be a bit too much. Don't you think? Oh, hey. I feel like it might be a good shout. But it's so big. No, I think it's... I don't know. I might leave it. I don't think it's scarf weather just yet. Hi, one ticket for the bus tour, please. It is the biggest scarf I've ever had to deal with. If I even twist it round. I mean, look. Hello. No, I think I'm gonna leave it. Okay, I'm taking it. I'm gonna put it in my, um, or do I take a backpack? I'm such a faff. Oh my God, that was the bloody Hoover. Yeah, I'm gonna take it, guys. I'm gonna put it in a backpack. Just like fold it up. Yeah, why not? And then I can just like, sort of wrap up once I'm on the, on the bus. Tonight's fragrance is the Oudgasm Rose Oud by Kai. Kaya, Kaya Ailey. This is incredible. So I'm like a very sad song at the minute. Do I, I don't need an umbrella though, do I? No, because if it rains, I could. <gasps> oh. oh my god, I thought that was a cockroach. It was a <laughs> I think I should stay at home. Umbrella, don't need it, got a hood, hat. Have I got my, have I got brain cells? No, I don't think so. Oh, okay. I'm on the next one, I think. So, uh, oh. so guys, I'm here. Literally, Victoria Station is just there. Cross the road. And actually, thank God I brought my scarf. Because um, when I was in the bathroom, I splashed loads of water on my um, jeans. And it looks like I've wet myself. So the scarf came in really, really handy. Ooh. 